not it. Nonsense. I want to accept this thing. That's not it. Alright. The way I was treated by society when I got pregnant was the most painful part because I was being rejected. I became a laughing stock. The probability of paternity is zero percent. Welcome to your favorite program. This is Tinashe Mugabe, the DNA man. I am coming from Global DNA International. And today we've traveled all the way to Kabwe. Kabwe is capital to the Zambian Central. And also, Kabwe was formerly called uh, the Broken Hill in 1902 after the discovery of two minerals, that's lead and zinc. And, zinc. and also, not worthy of mentioning is the fact that uh, Zambian is, uh, Kabwe is actually regarded uh, the, as the birthplace of the Zambian politics as many uh, meetings were convened here during the liberation, or should I say the colonial era. Uh, so today, as has always been the case, we are here to tackle a patent case. So I'm going to relate to the mother to hear the background of this case. Uh, Mommy, how are you doing? I'm fine, how are you? I am good, yes. So are you comfortable speaking English? Yes, I'm comfortable. Ah, wonderful. Thank you so much. Probably maybe if I can ask you, how old are you now? I'm 25. 25? Yeah. Uh, okay. And the child? It's uh, four years, six months. Four years, six months? Yes. All right, all right. So do you have, what's your totem, your totem? Do you do totems here? No. You don't? Ah, okay, that's great. So uh, I'd like to thank you also for welcoming, welcoming us into your, into your homestead. Oh. All right. Uh, so uh, 
could you please uh, relate how did your your relationship start with uh, the father to the child where did you meet what happened so i want you to narrate everything that happened so that i get to know uh what really transpired up to where we are today can you do that oh well, it met me by the lord side yeah we, i talk when i talked the my my brother you know called me to take the battery yeah that's when i that's when i found him there standing then he approached me we talked okay. to 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 alanda and then after takamba the day na after takamba then na bola na 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 bola ku nyumba after na bola ku nyumba ya kuchoka pa after after paja tabai tambo did see then we dated for some months mm -hmm. yeah. after that na bola na started discover that i was pregnant in june mm -hmm. uh, which was the 26th from that time sabara da from that time the nation is called school so we used to communicate just like that then after that i went after the discovery that i was pregnant i went i went to the hospital i discovered that i was pregnant and i brought the results from the hospital and gave it to the man from there we were talking we were talking and so the time i shift i was staying with my sister okay. yeah from there i shifted after i lost my two with them i shifted i went to saka to stay with my sister saka yeah we were communicating um, after from there mr the guy started mis started misbehaving yeah that's how the the communication stopped okay when shoka kuja then na bala na i stayed in saka for some years from there i came back in in kawo Okay. Yes, again we started the dating the the time I came here the child was one year and some months. Okay. Yeah. We started communicating with us too in good terms with the father of my son. Mm -hmm. We are communicating after that. Again we stopped communicating and started dating another guy. Okay. Yeah. So from there that's how we've been moved and so dates. All right. Okay, so that's what happened. Yeah. Ah, okay. Uh, what is the most painful part uh, of this uh, story of yours? Where do you really feel that you got injured so much, and uh, the, uh, to such an extent that the situation was so unbearable, you were hurt and you couldn't be? Do you recall those incidences? Uh, for him, the name of the child. Mm -hmm. That is not his child. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he even started chasing the child from his grave. Mm -hmm. yeah. From where? From where he stays. From where he stays. Yes. Oh, okay. He used to chase the child. All right, all right. So you are not staying together? No, we are stay alone. So you never stayed together? No, we never. Okay. So, at what, at what point did you inform him that you were pregnant? When I just discovered that I was pregnant. Well, like how many months? Mm -hmm. Uh, it was one month when was I was one month. Wow, oh, actually, some weeks so. Okay, all right, all right. How did he take it when you informed him about the news? Uh, you didn't take things seriously. Mm -hmm. Yeah, when I told him, he came and asked, started asking me, Should I tell my parents? Mm -hmm. And me, I told me, ah, It's up to you mm -hmm. to do that. Okay, yeah, all right, all right, all right. So, currently, uh, who, is, who is taking care of the child? See. And who are yourself alone? Yes. Okay. So is he doing anything for the child? No. Has he done anything before? Uh, no, no. Not at all. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. So you are the only person yeah. uh, who's taking care of the child. Yeah. All right, all right. What are your loved ones, your 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 parents, your relatives saying about this case and what they are it. They are what? They are it. They're, oh okay. What about the, his relatives? What are they saying about the issue? They're just quiet. They're just quiet. Yeah? Okay. Yeah, they, they were just waiting to get from him. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What do you regret in this whole issue? Uh, I regret nothing. Okay. Um. Okay. All right. So, from the time you got pregnant, that's when the relationship ended. With uh, yes. Okay. But when you were having the relationship as it was unfolding, 
did you were you really promising each other that you're going to stay together in the no, near future? We never did that. Okay. So when you started, like when he, how did you get into? I, I mean, uh, how did you get intimate? Uh, I mean, were you like in agreement to it? And what was the motive? Actually, me, I wasn't the bubble of it. Yeah, I just the guy was just forced me, the guy. The what? The guy mm -hmm. just forced me, but me, I wasn't the bubble of it. All right, so he forced you yeah. into it. Yeah. So you didn't consent to it? No. Is it? How old were you then? 20. Oh, you were 20. All right, so did you tell someone that uh, this, that's what happened? Yes, I, uh, no, I, no, I didn't. Okay, you didn't tell him no. Yeah, because you were in love. Yeah. Is it? Yeah. Ah, all right, all right, all right. So that's when it started? Yes. Continuously? Yeah. Ah, okay, okay. So, uh, during pregnancy, who assisted you with the preparation of uh, the preparation and men and the, the hospital bills and everything? Who was assisting you? My, my sister from Osaka. Okay, they assisted you? Yes. Ah, all right, all right. You said currently, how old is the child now? Four years, six months. Four years, six months. Okay, and the father's never done anything? No. Okay. To what extent does that pain you? It's really painful. Mm. What are the experiences that you encountered that really pained you as you were taking care of the child? Uh, I went through a road with the child. Tell me about it. Tell me everything about it. Because uh, the child usually gets sick. Mm -hmm. So uh, the one who takes him to the hospital, mm -hmm. even pays the bills. Yeah, but he doesn't go to school, actually. So that things really pains me. Mm -hmm. Okay. So. Okay. Okay. So were there no incidences whereby you couldn't even provide food for the child? Uh, no. Your ma, you are managing. Yes. All right. Okay. With the help of my sisters. Eh? Oh, your 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 sisters are helping. Yes. Ah, uh, all right, all right, all right. No, that's fine. So. At four years, is, he, is the child aware of this situation? No. Not yet. Okay. All right. No, that's all right, mommy. Thank you so much for telling us the uh, background to this story. Oh, you're okay. okay. No, that's fine. All right, we have uh, heard from the mother to the child in question. She has, she has given us the uh, side of the story. Now let's switch over to the alleged father to hear what he has to say. We are all over Zimbabwe. Conduct us today. How are you? Good, good. How are you? I'm well, thank you. Uh, all right, that's fine. Ah, uh, no, it's fine. I think I would rather sit here. You, this is your seat, yeah. Uh, thank you. All right. All right. That's fine. 
All right, so uh, we, I'm here now with the least father. We also need to hear what he has to say about the case. So let me uh, talk to him to hear the background of this case. Uh, all right, thank you so much for, for welcoming us. Uh, that's fine. Uh, I was just talking to, your, to the mother of the child. Uh, she has given us the side of the story. Now I need you to tell me what really transpired. How did the relationship start? Uh, up to where we are today. Where did you meet? Uh, what were the circumstances around the case? Up to where we are today. Are you able to do that? Yeah, I mean, it's uh, still 2018. Okay. It's uh, just moved up by the old seat. Okay. Yeah, I, I came to pick you. That's why I met her. I proposed love to her and that she accepted. Okay. Yes, that was 20, 2018. Okay. Yeah, 2018. And okay. This, how long did your relationship take? Um, just like four months like that. Okay, okay. Um, at, to, at what point did you start eating the porridge? Like uh, eating on air? Eating the porridge? Yes, yes, yes. How do you mean like eating the porridge? The porridge, like having intimate. Or having... Like, uh, being intimate with it. I yeah. started in 2019, in April. After some years? Uh, it was 2018 when I put it, in. Uh -huh. it was in December. Oh, December, okay. It was December 29, 2018. Then yeah, okay. Uh -huh. Just like started eating the porridge was on in June. June? Yes. The next year? The following year? year. Oh, okay, okay. okay. Yes. All right. Was it by agreement that you were going to eat so that you can have some kids? Or what was the purpose? What was the motive behind you yeah. having to partake of it? Mm. Mm. It's just uh, extend that. It's just meat. By the road, uh -huh. then we started kissing each other. Uh -huh. After kissing, and then we took us to what? To the? Yes. You took, you, 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 after kissing, then what? Then you went somewhere, and then. Where? Uh, but not see, just in the bush. Oh, in the bush? Yes. You were not scared, was it in the day or in the evening? It was in 20 hours. Okay, okay, so it wasn't that dark. But it wasn't that dark as much. As all right, all right, all right, all right. So that's how it started. Okay, after that, what happened? Uh, after that, we stayed from June, July, August. Mm -hmm. Then in October, she was pregnant. Okay. Just to tell me that, no, I'm pregnant. And I accepted it. Okay. But uh, by that time, she was already told. Okay. Uh, she was writing her exam. Okay. She was writing her exam. Mm -hmm. Then she went to Usaka. Uh -huh. Yes. After Usaka, 2020, 2020, she delivered in February. Okay. Yes, and I wasn't responsible for that. She appointed someone that was one was responsible for the, for the child. I oh. called her to ask her, am I responsible? And she said, no, you're not the one who is going to get me. Is it? With you, from now before, uh -huh. I lost you. And someone who said to her, uh -huh. for me. Okay. Yes. So she actually said that to you? Yes, she told me. Okay. Yes. How did you take it? Ah. I didn't take it seriously, I just ah. uh, it's fine. Mm -hmm. Yes, I didn't move to it in my life. All right. Yes. Okay. So after she gave birth, what happened? No, after she gave she, uh, she gave birth, she uh, she had to name her son a person. Mm -hmm. And uh, even the son wasn't mine. Okay. Case. All right. So you, that's how the relationship ended? That's how the relationship ended, but she used to call me sometimes. Mm -hmm. Now I'm fine, that's not okay. in this story. All right. So uh, did you do something for the baby? Like you didn't even do anything for the baby? No, you didn't even buy anything. Because of that statement that she said? Yes, because of the statement that she gave. All right. So have you seen the child? How often do you see the child? Are you guys neighbors? Yeah, we are neighbors. OK. So how often do you meet the child? I meet the child, but sometimes I greet her. Sometimes you say, Akoman, that's my name. Mm -hmm. We just touch the child. OK. All right, but if you look at the child, do you res res does, the, does the child resemble something, I mean, your features? Yeah. And as no. far as the appearance is concerned? People have been, they have been they tell me that you resemble. Mm -hmm. The way I look, the way I smile, uh -huh. you resemble like that. Is it? But uh, uh -huh. there's a guy. Mm -hmm. Who called me some um, some uh, this year. Mm -hmm. So I don't know how she how, how he got my name. Okay. So he called me to say how are you? I'm fine. I'm good to us. Even on Facebook, mm -hmm. we are friends. Yeah. So he said, they told me that no, do you know what's me? That that uh, 
son's mind. Mm -hmm. How? Mm -hmm. Who says yes? Yeah, I know that you're responsible. Mm -hmm. So he, he, that guy was responsible. Okay. Yes, all these years. All oh, right. Buying everything, mm -hmm. doing everything. Mm -hmm. yeah. But he, he called me to say, no, oh, that one, even the name of the son, mm -hmm. uh, the same guy. Now the father is late. Uh -huh. Yes, he named the son. Reso. Which father? The one who called me. Okay. He's explained it, everything for me. Oh, he's late now? Yeah, he's the, the, the father to the guy. Yeah, okay. Oh, okay, okay. Ah, I get you. Okay, okay. So, it's the mother who came back to you to tell you that this child should be yours, or it's just the phone call? Ah, uh, the mother came to me. Okay. No, sorry for the thing that I've done with you. Yes. Yeah, but just to tell you the, the truth, uh -huh. this child is yours. Okay. Yes, this child is yours. All right. So, so, do you have any proof? Because uh, looking at the sun, you can look at everything. It's not even responsible for this child. Mm -hmm. You can keep my child after all these years. You uh -huh. said, no, this is not my child. You said, okay. no. At that time, I don't know what just came into my mind. Okay. But I just have to review to see this is your child. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. All right. Uh, are there instances whereby you could sense that uh, she was cheating on you? Or she was doing something that you really didn't understand? Uh, sometimes when I was, uh, some other guys used to call her. Okay. Is where are you like that? But mm -hmm. never used to take that serious. Maybe just, you know, I will see you like that now. Mm -hmm. Yes, Ah, okay, okay. Night okay. goes, yes. Ah, all right. Yeah. So, are you married now? No, I'm not married. Okay. You want to resolve this case and then you move ahead? Yes, I just want to, to know now the, the fact of it. All right, all right. So, it's you who is actually desirous to know the truth? It's me who wants to know the truth. Oh, so the mother is not at all persistent about this case? Oh, uh, the by that time, I told her that, no, you should have said that yeah, it's my child, but I'll take a step further. Mm -hmm. To, to go for DNA. Okay. And it came with a program to them on TV. That's when I said that this is good now. Okay. Mm -hmm. So where is this other father that you're talking about? The other father, even I was trying to communicate. He called me even yesterday. Mm -hmm. uh, he's in Nakond. Nakond? Yes. How far is it from here? Ah, it's very far. But uh, yesterday he called me that he's going to Shirundu, uh -huh. but he will be passing, mm -hmm. going back to Nakond. All right. Yes, will be passing by car. But, uh, when I was sitting there, he called me, but he didn't have enough time to, to communicate. I said, no, I'll call you. Okay. Yes. All right. Yeah, we have uh, heard from the late father. He's uh, narrated what he knows about this case. Now we need to do the DNA uh, sample collection. So I'm going to invite the mother and the child in question so that we immediately uh, do the sample collection. All right, we have uh, tried our level best uh, to hear how this case unfolded from the very onset. And uh, we have also heard from the mother and uh, uh, the alleged father as well. And the DNA symbol, symbols has been collected. So you keep glued and keep following us as we take an exploration into this case. So we'll come back again with the DNA results. Looking for hassle-free property buying, selling or renting? Hannah Meal Properties has got you covered wherever you are. Our expert team offers a range of services including property sales, management, development, construction, project supervision and more. We deal in residential, commercial and industrial properties and provide legal document preparation services with expert lawyers, saving you time and money while ensuring a safe and secure legal transaction. So why wait? Get in touch with us today. Welcome to your favorite program. This is Tinashe Mugabe, the DNA man. And as we previously highlighted, that we will bounce back with the DNA results for this couple that we have here in Kabwe. So today we are back again with the DNA results. So let's just have a recap 
of what has been transpiring since the time we left on the initial interview to hear how their life has been unfolding. So let me relate to the alleged father once again to hear what he has to say. All right, so I'd like to thank you once again for welcoming us to your home state, sir. Thank you, welcome. All right, yes, I remember we came last time. Yes, I remember. How has been your life from the time we came up to this point in time? Yes, sir, but the time we came yes, up to now, yes, it has been, they have put me in pressure. Okay. Yes, I was asking me about the results, that when the results coming out, mm -hmm. yes, and then uh, so far they, they told, told me that if those people, they won't come, then they will take me to court. Okay. It's so no wonder I was busy calling you, to know the day that you are coming, but oh. it's good that you have come. Ah, all right, all right. Mm. Yeah, I remember you highlighted the issues about the child's uh, welfare. Are you not taking care of the child or what? What's happening regarding the child? Uh, I'm not sure about the child. As at now, I'm not even caring about that. The uh -huh. same child, yes. Uh -huh, uh -huh. yes. So you're not providing anything for the child currently? I'm not providing anything now, as at now, yes. Okay. Yes. So are you in touch with the, the family members from the maternal? I uh, know. They're not in touch, yes. You're not? Yeah, no. All right, but do you greet one another when you meet seeing you're staying in the same neighborhood? Ah, uh, no. We don't meet. Why? I would just meet, you know, when I meet her, uh, maybe I'm with my friends, see, so we just pass by each other uh -huh. without saying hi to each other. Okay. It's the only okay. thing that she has, she has been doing for me, just to be pressuring me that when are, you, when are those people coming. Oh, okay. Yes. Ah, all right, all right. So tell me, uh, there's this gentleman that you once mentioned about uh, the one that you said was also involved in that lady, uh, at the same time you were also involved. Yes. Uh, have you managed to get in touch with him and what is uh, the feedback coming from him? Yeah, the, 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 the feedback. Immediately, you, the same day that you came here and you left, Yes. he called me. Uh -huh. I was the results and then I told him that so the, the results will come after three weeks. Okay. And then he said, no, my blow is fine, you can go ahead. Mm -hmm. You can go ahead with the, the, the child. I said, no. I'm not against with you, the child or whatever, no, not mine. But once the results come out, then the results will be ours, the truth. Okay. Yes. Ah, uh, or so he's also waiting for the results, just like you are waiting for ah, the but results. See, ever since that time up to now, you haven't been, you haven't called me. Okay. Yes. Oh, so you were not talking? Ah, no. Ah, all right, all right, all right. No, I get you. So basically, if you are to recap, uh, you said, what were the issues that actually led you to deny the responsibility of this child? How many issues did you mention that time? Ah, the issues that, that I mentioned was like uh, when she was pregnant. Uh -huh. she, she did not say that she's my pregnant, no. Mm -hmm. She appointed someone who's the same girl who's Nakonde. Oh yeah, that guy, yes. That's Nakonde, yes. Okay. Uh -huh. Then, uh, as, as this year, she's in, uh, is four years. Mm -hmm. Four years, yes. And then uh, this year, April, uh -huh. then they came to me to say, no, this is your child. Mm -hmm. So I was like, ah, all these years, I've been telling me that this is my child, and then how come I've come this year to say that it's my child. Uh -huh. Yeah, so now on I go to line, I was watching the dam on TV, so I want, I want to, to test the DNA for the child so that I know the truth. All right, all right. Yes. Okay, so that was basically the main reason yes. that uh, fasted you to come uh, for a DNA test. Yes. Uh, okay, okay. So how has been your mind? How have you been like, uh, have you been like in terms of uh, the moment you think about this issue? How did you feel? Ah, I think I'm not bothered so much. Yes, I'm, not bothered. Yes, I'm not bothered. Yeah. Okay. Yes, I'm just free, free mind, not even thinking about what's what. Ah, all right, yes. all right. Okay. Mm -hmm. Ah, so basically that's what happened. Yeah. Uh, that's fine. Say, thank you so much for giving us a uh, uh, your uh, a recap, or did I say a brief uh, background to your case? Okay. All right. We have heard from the late father. He has actually uh, uh, refreshed us uh, regarding uh, the case that we once handled here. So now we also need to invite the mother as well as we are drifting towards the general result presentation. So your fasten your belts will be what's in picture. Here. Alright, now we've just been joined by the mother to the child in question. So let's hear what has been uh, transpiring in her life. How has she been? And may, maybe a recap of uh, uh, the main factors why he had to point this alleged father as the father to the child in question. Uh, thank you, Mami, for coming once again. And I'm so glad to meet you once again. You're welcome. Alright, so tell me, how have you been? 
from the time we left when we do the when we did the DNA assemble collection up to this point in time, how has been your your life? How has been your experiences regarding this case? It has been good. Okay. Yeah, I'm just cool. Uh -huh. uh, yeah, like always. All right. So have you been talking to the father? Yeah, no. At times. Okay. You were talking. Yes. About what issues? Uh, concerning the same the same issue. It was okay. Yeah. Exactly what? What exactly? Uh, like I was ask, just asking mm -hmm. about about the same issue. Like when uh, are they bringing the results? Uh -huh. uh, yeah. All right. Yes. Okay. By the way, you, you the last time you we came, you said there were issues that led you uh, into uh, actually alleging that he is the father to the child. Uh, what were these issues, by the way? Sorry. The issues that uh, made you point that him is the father to the child. Uh, actually, I never pointed him. Huh? Yeah, actually, I never pointed him. Okay. Yeah, he just came. I told me to say, at first he came and said that he came and introduced the child to, to his family. Okay. Yes. And after some times, there was a certain man I was dating uh -huh. before I knew him. Okay. Yes. So he saw the pics on social media. Okay. Yeah, I don't know who showed him. So after that, he came I started chasing the child. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And after some times, then he, he called me. Uh -huh. Say, I will be. Uh, there will be people will be coming. Uh -huh. Yes, from DNA. Okay. Yes, they'll 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 come here to do a DNA test. Okay. Yes, he wanted to be sure if that child is his child. All right. Yes, because he was telling me to say the child looks like uh, the same guy I was dating before okay. I knew him. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, okay, okay. Also, oh, that's basically what happened. Yes. Okay, okay. So you said you did it these two guys at the same time. No, it was different times. Yes, it was a difference of how many. Uh, how many the first guy I dated them, uh, I started dating when I was in grade ten, which was twenty sixteen. Uh -huh. And this guy I knew him in twenty seventeen. Oh, okay, okay, okay. But did you tell the father that he, he, there were there are time differences there? Yes. The times that you did. Yes. yes, I did. Okay, so but you didn't accept that. Yes, we didn't. Ah, uh, okay, okay. So that's basically what happened. Yes. So we said you said who's taking care of the child now? Myself and my family. Oh, okay. And nothing is coming from the father's side. No. Or? Okay. Mainly because of that question. Yes. Okay. All right. So how has been a feeling since uh, you've been taking care of this child alone? How has been the burden like? And uh, what were your experiences? Oh well, no, it hasn't been a bad day because. Mm -hmm. uh, I've been receiving help from my family. Okay. Yes. So I haven't experienced any bad thing from any oh, All right, all right, all right, all right. Thank you, Peter. All right. What is the most disappointing part of this story of yours? Ah, uh, okay. The most disappointing part of me is that, see, uh, how can I say it? Uh, of him, mm -hmm. of him, um, saying that see uh, I had I was just making up plans to say that he is the father of that mm -hmm. child. Mm -hmm. Well it's just the father. Oh. Yes, I just wanted him to I just wanted to point him to say that he's the father, well it's not the father. Mm -hmm. So that got me to seems to to me as an embarrassment. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, okay, okay. So how did you overcome that? Oh, I just uh, accepted the thing then mm -hmm. Yeah, and the most thing that made me to be so cool is when you said that you you be coming here as they you bring the thing it is here. Yes. All right, all right. So you actually saying that you were happy. When yeah, you I was happy. announced about the DNA yeah. process. Uh, okay. Yeah, because I, I wanted to be, I wanted to cure that embarrassment. Okay. All right, all right. So how has been the society? How, how, I mean, what has the society been saying? Regarding your story, ah, uh, they were saying that uh, I'm more like uh, I can say it, I'm a manizer. Uh -huh. I'd like I uh, pointed two guys at the same time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't really know the the real father of my child. Mm -hmm. All right, yeah. How old is the child now? Uh, four years. Six. Four years. Okay. What is he saying about about the, this issue? Does he know? Is he aware that the father is is nowhere to be found currently? Uh, but uh, it came. Mm -hmm. 
and and told him to say you should be coming, you should be calling me. I'm your father, or God, yeah, he came to to tell himself. Oh, okay, okay. This he came to the yeah. place. Okay, okay. So he's aware that he is my father. Ah, okay. No, that's fine. And what is your mom, dad saying? Your family, family members? Uh, my family members were saying that, say, uh, how come he, he didn't inform us that you'll be bringing, you people will be coming for mm -hmm. the interviews and okay. for the tests. All right. Yeah. All right, all right. But that was that issue resolved? Yeah. Not actually. Uh huh. Yeah, first they're waiting for the results. Oh, okay. Yeah. Then they'll take a step further. Yes. Ah, that's wonderful. Thank you, Mommy, for, for, for giving us your side of the story. All right, so we have uh, done the recap. They've actually uh, related to us uh, what has been transpiring, their experiences since the last time we came when we did the, the, the symbol collection. But now we need to invite both the father and the mother as we look deeper into this space. We'll be right back. Now we've just been joined by the two as we look deeper into this case. Uh, I'd like to thank you, sir, for coming back and you, ma'am. Uh, I think I would like you also to refresh us on how your relationship started. Where did it happen and how did it happen? To yes, yes. Yeah, I can't remember the day. Okay. It's just a uh, meet by the road. Okay. Yes, I mean, you said the proposal out to her and she accepted it. Uh -huh. yes. Okay. For how long did you guys date? If you are not mistaken, that was 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20. Yes, 20. Ah, okay, okay. So you said uh, when you, from the day you met up to the time you started eating for it, uh, 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 how long was it? From 2018, that was November. Uh -huh. then when did you eat for it? 20, same year 2018. Same year 2018. Same year After 20. how many months? Uh, it was, that was uh, 2018, June. It was June, yes. June, July, exactly. Uh, okay, Mami. Mami, can you maybe help him? Yeah, it was, uh, it was 2017. Uh -huh. Yeah, that was when I was in grade 11. That's when you? I was in grade 11. Okay. Yeah, okay. So that's when you dated? Yes. Okay. So from the day he gave you the proposal, or the day you accepted the proposal, up to the day he started eating porridge, how long was it? June. Uh -huh. Yeah. From June until yeah, I slept in June. In June. Uh -huh. In June, yes. Yes. The and same month you did, you, you accepted the proposal. Uh, no, that was in. No, yeah, I said that was in November. Uh -huh. Sorry, November. Then I said with him in first eighteen, which was June. Oh, it was June. Yeah. So yeah, some months in between. Ah, yeah. uh, okay, okay. So how has been the relationship? Uh, complicated. Complicated how? It was like uh, we never used to be like in such in hotels. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But like we're just fighting. Oh, okay. like we're not eating. Oh, okay. Fretting. All right, all right. Okay, say, so do you have to say something about that? Nothing. The relationship, about the relationship? Uh, huh? Nothing. What about that? Nothing to say. No, you're not even saying, but he, what he's saying is the truth. What she's saying is the truth. Eh? Ah, okay, okay. No, that's fine. So, tell me, say, you, you once went to a, a year place and you informed the child that I'm your dad. Uh, what gave you the energy to do that? Okay, sometimes, uh, at that time, uh, I took PSO, uh -huh. took me amnesia. Uh -huh. like that. I was overthinking, so I went there. Yes. And I said that this is my child. 
Okay. Who did Oh, it was it. Ah, okay, okay, okay. So it was only because you were under the influence of alcohol. Yes, under the influence. Okay, mommy, is that so? Was it drunk? Okay. So it did that once. Ah. Three times. Three times. Yeah. And all, all the three times it was drunk. At times, yeah, but not that much. Okay. All right. Say, so, were you drunk for the three times that you went there? Uh, I can just remember one day. Oh, one day. Oh, you remember one day? One day. All oh, right. That, that's the day that you remember that you actually drank? Yes. Ah, okay. Okay. But wait, what were you thinking? Do you recall your, your uh, the mental processes that you're having that actually led you into going there and actually uh, declare yourself to be the father of the child? No, I was coming back from somewhere. So okay. I met them. I yeah. just at the door, sitting with mm -hmm. another guy. Mm -hmm. He's my friend. Okay. So my, one of my friends called me to say, come here, what you did for you to invite my dad on TV wasn't good. Uh -huh. That story we could just call parents and then we sit together and then we solve that. Uh -huh. Rather than you start calling my dad on for DNA or whatever, whatever like that. Oh, okay. Oh, it's, it's, it's happened recently. Yeah. Ah, okay, okay. All right. Mommy, that's all. Okay, that's fine. So, uh, coming to you, mommy, you, you took long before you could tell or him that you could be the father of the child. Why did it take such a long time before telling him? I'm sure he, I never wanted to do so. And I never followed him in any ways to say that he's the father of my child. You never what? I never followed him. Okay. Yeah. Anyways, he just came up and took the child, came and introduced him to his family. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but me, I never appointed him as the father of my child. Okay. Yes. Can you respond to that, sir? Uh, well, I remember last year, he used to tell me that, no, no, this is your child. Mm -hmm. Then I used to refuse. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. He, he's saying you, you, it's you who was actually telling him that you're the father. I'm not sure. Wait, I remember that. Because, no, she was saying that she, no, I just want to open with you. And I don't want to carry bad things with someone. Uh -huh. Yeah, the new child, yeah, the new father for this child, not the one who's, who's in the country. Mm -hmm. Your relationship with him, it, it, it ended to such an extent that you could not even communicate with him just after you fell, you fell pregnant. We used to communicate, no, but not like that much. Oh, about the baby, were you also communicating? No. Why? I just thought like not talking about the child because I, I used to manage <coughs> keeping the child, yeah. Okay. Uh, you, you, you were managing on your own? Yes. What if it comes out today that you are not the father to the child in question? What are you going to say? I'll just accept. Okay. Okay, and then what if it comes that you are the father to the child? I'll accept and be the responsible. <laughs> is it of the child and, the, and, no, and not the mother? Not anymore? Okay, no, that's fine. So, mommy, if it comes out that you are not, he's not the father or is the father, you are, you are comfortable with ah, it. Of course, with any outcome. Ah, wonderful. Thank you so much. All right, we have tried our level best to look deeper into this case, but now it's necessary that we have to give them the general results. So, uh, you fasten your belts, we'll be bouncing back shortly.
Welcome back. Now we're entering into the DNA result presentation time. I believe you are now ready to hear the results. Say, are you ready to hear the results? Mm -hmm. Okay, mommy, are you ready to hear the results? Mm -hmm. And you are the sister to the mother, right? To the father. Oh, yeah, the sister to the father. Are you also ready to hear the results? Ah, thank you. Yeah, on this test, uh, we had three parties uh, that were involved in the test. That is the uh, mother, uh, the child, and the alleged father. So our results read as thus: the alleged father is excluded as the biological father of the tested child. Uh, the probability of paternity is a zero percent. In simpler terms, uh, say you are not the father to the child in question. Uh, mommy, he is uh, not the father at all to this child. Mm. Yes, so now we get this paper. Yes, you can tell it's your certificate, yes. It's a, okay. Thank you. Okay. Now, now, have a question. All right, okay. Especially, can I, like, can I, can I, like, ask myself, before I went to to meet the same guy in Nakonde, mm -hmm. this was the first guy I slept. Okay. And before I slept with that guy from Nakonde, that uh -huh. was two months after. Okay. Yes. So how come, how can this not be the father of that child? Oh, it was two months. Yeah. Uh, when I asked you initially, you said it was uh, like two years, right? No. Before, uh, I slept with this guy. Mm. That was June. Ah. Then I went to Nakonde, which was in August. Okay. Yes, that's when I slept with that guy. Okay. Yes. Now, how, how can this, this not be the father of that child? Okay, yeah, according to the results, uh, he is not the father. So that's where we are right now. So what is now necessary is for us to maybe to test him, that uh, gentleman from Nakonde as well, and to see the outcome. We also do that free of charge and help you until we resolve the matter. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you so much, mommy. So anyways that you have to say about? No, nothing. Or even to the father, to, no, the, to him? I have to say. All right. Say, say your words, what do you have to say about the result? I will not that the results are okay. Okay. So I'll just be a choose. You what? I was just being accused to the uh, child. Uh -huh. So now I'm free now. Okay. Yes. All right, all right. Mm -hmm. That's fine. What do you have to say to mommy? Okay. okay. Two friends, yes. Is what? There are two friends, yes. Uh huh. Yeah, that's all. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, Auntie, what do you have to say? Nothing. Are you happy about the results? Yes. Okay. That's fine. So, are you going to help us now to to locate this alleged father? Are you going to still be involved since you're the one calling no, him? No, I'm not going to be involved. Yeah? No, my sister. Which one? To, to the mother. Okay. Can't then can be involved because it's not the, we said he's not the father. The result oh, so yeah, you, yeah. you can help us to locate him, right? Yes, I can. Ah, wonderful. That's fine. So, you you get in touch with him and then we uh, give you instruction on how you can be tested. Was you can even be tested here in Kabwe, we have a center in Kitke or Lusaka. So, anywhere nearby uh, regarding here where is whereabouts, then you yourself, him, and the child can be tested again. All right, Zikomo, we have come to the end of the case that we're handling here today in Kabwe. Indeed, the part is concerned. I uh, have gained peace of mind, especially on the part of the father. But, uh, however, we as two have got a journey uh, as we explore this case further because we need to figure out who could be the father if he is not the father to the child in question. So the journey continues and uh, we will bounce back giving you feedback on the other DNA uh, test that is going to be held. So if you also have a pending case, feel free to get in touch with us uh, on the numbers provided on the screen for your service. And by the way, we are there to give you these services without any fear, without any favor, and without any bias. So this is National Without the DNA Man signing out.